Post-match here with Tom Jonas. TJ, obviously not the game we wanted against the Pies. Talk us through what went wrong today. Yeah, I mean, sort of lessened by a quality team, but absolutely no excuse for the inconsistency that we showed from last week to this week. Uh, he learned from the Frio game, it was contests. They worked for us last week, and we didn't come and dish it up again today. Just coming out of the team meeting with Ken, what was his message about the performance and trying to unlock that consistency week to week? Yeah, the reality is we're not quite there yet. Um, we're trying to build trust as a group, but uh, performances like that is a first step back. So you go back to what you do during the week, and that's the easy, easy moments to build trust by doing everything right in the lead up to a game. But ultimately, it's your actions on game day that uh, you know what's going to consolidate that and doing it regularly. It's obviously a pretty young midfield now with Jason, Connor, Zach running through it. Is there anything you guys as leaders do to, to get around those guys, obviously coming up against a quality outfit like Collingwood and, and for the rest of the season? Oh, yeah, absolutely. I mean, there's a balance between um, a pat on the back and what you're doing well, but also these are the things you can learn from someone like Collingwood or these are the things you need to be aware of, aware of going into Collingwood or the Crows next week. Um, so it's, it's getting that balance right. And ultimately... Um, holding people to account for their performance. We saw last week against the Lions how good the crowd was for us today. Pretty hostile crowd going against us. How are you working through with the boys sort of managing that different week to week, having support behind us and support against us? Yeah, I mean, there's certainly certainly an element of um, embracing the animosity. I certainly love when um, they're against us, back against the wall time mentality. I think that's Port Adelaide mentality, but um, I mean, it might not be the same for everyone, so it's something worth exploring. Eyes obviously go forward now to showdown. They're pretty big games in SA, and the added element of wearing the prison bars next week. What's the messaging going to be throughout the week, and, and how are you going to get these boys up for that game as well? Yeah, review the Collingwood game, learn lessons from that, um, and then start displaying consistent behaviours from training that we can take into the Crows game. Ultimately, like it's, it's a privilege to wear the prison bars and better play the right way when you wear them. Thanks for your time, Tom.